Montgomery County is giving Napa Valley a run for its money as a premier wine destination as the county gains worldwide recognition for its booming wine industry. Action News reporter Bianca Beltran with the story. You can't beat it here. There's, I mean, you can go down the road anywhere you want through here, any one of these wineries, you got some good wines. The growing attention to the coastal vineyards is putting Monterey County on many lists of top wine destinations in the world. It's secret. Location, location, location. It's like the SLH Appalachian. It's premier growing conditions for Chardonnays and Pinots, and that's what we've been known for the last couple of years. Napa Valley has made a name for itself with its 47,000 acres of vineyards, but Monterey County is not far behind with 45,000 acres of vineyards. And about half of the grapes grown in Monterey County are sent to areas like Santa Barbara, Sonoma, and even Napa to use in their wine. Growth has been phenomenal for me. Uh, we're actually doing uh, twice as much business as we did at the last year. Sam Martinez runs Monterey Guided Wine Tours, taking visitors to wineries along the Salinas Valley. I've had to add more cars to my fleet and additional drivers uh, so that we can take care of the growing uh, demand for wine tours out here. Monterey County is even attracting winery owners from Napa, like Gregory Ahn, who recently acquired former Chateau Julien. Ahn says he sees opportunities for growth. Because so much of our grape growing happens out in the Salinas Valley, it's much harder to access those wineries because there's not, um, you know, a infrastructure to support it. And that's the next step for the industry in the area. We need drivers and we need transportation. We need businesses that take people to wineries. In the meantime, visitors are enjoying the low-key vibe. More individual attention, I think. It is more personalized service. Just, just uh, you know, just on a, you know, great wine on a smaller scale. Reporting in Salinas, Bianca Beltran, KSBW Action News 8.